What is going on everyone? It's Kavari Tech Media aka Caleb here and in today's video guys We actually pretty much winged it. Okay, we started off at two different boat launches I was just trying to find a place where I could actually fish. It was so daggum windy starting off um, so basically the first two hours of the day I spent trying to avoid the wind and uh, finally the weather calmed down the winds laid down and I was able to just get out to an area that I would actually like to fish and that's exactly what happened but instead of using artificial lures today I thought about doing something different I found a lot of fiddler crabs so I decided to try and change it up a little bit try and uh, you know try a new technique and that's exactly what we did guys I found some fiddler crabs and I decided to fish these fiddler crabs around um, rock piles and you know all different types of structure because I know there's redfish I know there's black drum around this area so that's exactly what we did guys we caught some fiddler crabs and we were just simply fishing these things around rocks oysters all that good stuff targeting a variety of different species so really fun day something that I've never really done before and uh, I hope you guys enjoy it as well so that's the video folks if y'all do enjoy leave a like shoot me a thumbs up really does help me out leave a comment make sure you guys subscribe and uh until next time tight lines guys y'all check out the size of that freaking fiddler crab that thing is going to get destroyed by a redfish all right guys what i'm gonna do since it's a little bit windy is i am gonna set up a knocker rig with a one fourth ounce uh, weight on there just to get this thing to the bottom. Because one thing that I noticed is that right now it's really windy and these crabs are just not going to the bottom. So I'm fixing to make just a simple knocker rig and that way this thing will go down to the very bottom where I want it to because that's where those redfish are feeding right now. They're just on the bottom rooting through oyster and rock. So hopefully this will work guys i think this is going to actually work a lot better but come on let's get a redfish or a <laughs> tell y'all what i'm really hoping we get a big ugly today that would be incredible all right so let me show you guys what we are going to use for bait i don't want this thing to pinch me just like that guys Look at how big that fiddler crab is. These, these things are freaking giant. Like, just giant. Y'all, check that out right there. This thing is fixing to get destroyed. Let that thing sink down to the bottom. There's a lot of oysters. There's a lot of rock down there, guys. So that's why we want that thing to go to the very bottom. Because that's where those fish are going to be feeding. Now, the thing about fishing with crabs, guys, is that you have to let these fish eat. You've got to let them eat. Yeah, I think something's on here, guys. Something. Got him. There we go, baby. Got him. Ah. There we go. Oh my god, are you serious? Oh, it's a stupid catfish. <laughs> well, that is not what we want, guys. It's not what we want. So we're gonna get him off the hook very carefully. Come here, dude. Come here, buddy. Gosh dang, I thought that was a redfish or something. Mm. All right, not the targeted species, guys. Not the targeted species, but hey, we caught something, so that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. You know, at least we're not uh, just catching nothing. All right, guys, second bait going out. Golly, I thought that was like a sheep's head or a redfish. Golly, would it be so cool? if we caught a sheep's head.
But like I said, guys, you know, it's fun to just catch something. You know, even if it's a saltwater catfish, <laughs> I'll take it. Guys, this fishing is actually a lot of fun. Like, it really is. Ooh, something big just spooked right here, guys. I'm talking really big. That could have been a black drum. I saw the boil from his tail, or something's tail. I don't know what that could have been. Yeah, there's definitely oyster down there, guys. Ooh, that was a good bite. Oh, no, 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 no. Guys, I just had a good bite. All right, guys, I had a really good bite. The last, the last cast, really good bite. Guys, that right there might be the biggest fiddler crab I have ever seen. <laughs> that thing is just a freaking giant. Like, oh my gosh. Oh, guys, get a bite. Got him, got him, got him, guys. Nice fish right here. Here we go on the crab. That feels like a red. Oh, dude, come on. That's how we do it, guys. I don't know what this is. It could even be a sheep's head. Oh my God, it is a sheep's head. Oh my God. How did I call that? How did I freaking call that, guys? Oh my goodness gracious. Dude, here we go, folks. Yes. He swallowed it. He swallowed it, but he is a keeper. Guys, I just had a nice bite and I was like convinced that I had a sheep's head. Oh my gosh, that is how we do it, guys. I think he is 100% 12 inches as well. Nice. There's dinner, baby. Woo. Guys, my fiance is going to be so happy. We got fish on the menu tonight. On the fiddler crab, folks. That is insane. On the knocker rig. Let's get this guy off the freaking hook. Dude. Holy crap, you weren't going anywhere, bud. All right, guys, let's get our bump board just to make sure that he is uh, 12 inches. Oh, yeah. Nice. He is 14, guys. 14 inch sheep's head right there. Y'all check that out. That is a awesome start to the day after that catfish. Wow. Wow, I just had this weird feeling that we were gonna catch a sheep's head, guys, and what do you know? Sheep's head it is. All right, let's get him in the Yeti, folks, and let's get back to fishing. That's disgusting, I need to wash off my hands. All right, on the Fiddler Crab, guys, that is, that is freaking cool. This is a lot of fun. Hope you guys are enjoying. If y'all are, leave a like, and uh, let's get another crab out there. All right, guys, let's get another crab. I need to clip this tag in too, but this is the bait right here, guys. Just a little fiddler crab. We are gonna fry that sheep's head up and he is going to be fantastic. That was so cool, guys. All right, guys, y'all didn't see it because my GoPro died as soon as i hooked it but i actually just caught another catfish i was like freaking out for a second trying to get my battery switched um but then i saw that it was a catfish so i just went ahead and uh, took it off released it but um that's what happened guys so we just switched batteries <sighs> really hoping to catch a nice red guys come on we need a redfish we need a redfish
Got him. Big fish. 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 Oh, there we go, guys. Big. Oh my gosh. Big fish. That could be the red, baby. Oh my god. Oh my god. Guys, big freaking fish. There we go, guys. Oh my gosh. We got ourselves a stud, baby. Uh, we gotta be really careful with this pylon right here. Or not pylon, but... Making sure my hat's on. Guys, this is a freaking stud. Come on, baby. On the fiddler crap. That is what I'm talking about, guys. Who would have known? I honestly just winged it today. Oh my gosh, nice, nice redfish. There we go, guys. I didn't even have to do anything. I just casted this thing out, and as soon as it hit the water, it got smoked by this freaking redfish. Oh my God, what a red. I don't even know if he's gonna be slot, but if he, actually guys, I think that thing's gonna be perfectly slot. Come on, dude. There we go, baby. Woo! That's how we do it, guys. On the freaking fiddler crabs. Yes. Oh, what a fish. What a fish, guys. Look at that thing right on the top of the mouth. Oh my gosh, dude. Just an absolutely gorgeous fish right there. All right, buddy, you're going home. I'm sorry, but uh, we need some, some fresh fish tonight. So you're gonna make the cut. Let's go ahead and Put this net. Come on. All right, guys, let's put this, put this girl on the board and see what she measures. Oh yeah. Beautiful, beautiful 23, or not, yep, 23 inch redfish right there, guys. An absolutely beautiful, beautiful fish that is how we do it baby we got our redfish let's put him in the cooler and uh guys let's get some more crabs out golly who would have known i mean honestly this wasn't my plan today um guys i actually went to two different boat launches prior to this spot because this spot was so rough starting out and uh, i was like there's no way that i was going to be able to fish today but the wind somewhat calmed down still a little bit windy but we made it happen guys on the fiddler crab that's how it's done folks